Steve from Cobra Garden Machinery and today I'd like to talk about this particular model which is the RM46 SPB which is an 18 inch self propelled rear roller lawnmower powered by the new Briggs & Stratton 500E overhead valve engine which is a 140cc engine. The reason somebody would buy this particular model of um, Cobra lawnmower is based on the person that's very passionate about their garden, they love the traditional English stripe on the lawn, they've probably got a lot of flower beds, they've got borders, so consequently the massive advantage of a rear roller machine is you can go over the border, cut to the edge, and this is the main reason why these machines are becoming more and more popular with the rear roller. I'd just like to talk about the actual engine fitment that is on this Cobra self-propelled rear roller machine. It's the latest Briggs & Stratton engine, it's the 500E 140cc overhead valve engine. It's a very good engine, very easy to start. I will actually go just through the starting of the engine for this particular model. On the left hand side of the machine there is a primer system where on the first instance when you're starting the machine you would push the primer bulb in three times which would get the fuel into the carburetor you would then go to the machine again you would hold the red lever in which is ready to engage the engine you would make sure the throttle control was on choke you would then pull the recoil <laughs> And then to stop the engine, you would release the OPC control. The Cobra model that I'm showing you today, again some more features, it's got full bearings in the wheels, it's got good quality robust wheels, it's also got a double bolted axle with these three points combined, the bearings, the robust wheels, the good quality axle, it's going to give you many years of service. One of the features which I particularly like on this machine is the height of cut. It's got a very ergonomic pistol grip handle which is so easy to use. You can go down to 17 millimeters and you can go all the way up to 75 millimeters which is the highest point of cut. Again, if you've got undulating surfaces on the grass, you can go to height number three which is approximately 30 millimeters. Again, it's absolutely effortless. You can see I'm taking no effort whatsoever to adjust the height of cut. It's a fantastic design and so easy to use. Another great feature I like about this machine is these two cam lock handles. If you've got a lawnmower but space is an issue, obviously you need to keep it somewhere safe for storage. I think this is a really good idea. All you need to do when you finish cutting the grass, you release both those levers, you then fold the handles over where it sits just on top of the engine and straight away once you've taken the grass box off the machine as well you've reduced, reduced the size of the lawnmower by 50% what a great feature I'd now like to talk about obviously a very important feature which is the collection of the grass this particular machine has a 60 litre hard based grass bag it's got the hard based top, the canvas sides and this little gadget that you can see in the top right hand corner is a flap on the machine and what happens is when grass is being cut the pr principle of it being cut is air is sucked underneath the deck which helps get the grass into the bag so therefore on this machine when you are cutting the grass this flap will be hovering at about 30 degrees which indicates you've got the correct airflow going through the machine and you know that there is still capacity in the box for the collection of the grass when the flap actually lays flat, what it is actually telling you is the grass bag is full. At this point, you need to kill the engine and empty the grass. I'd just like to summarize on the products we've been talking about today. I'll just start with this one here. Again, this is the 18 inch self-propelled Cobra rear roller machine fitted with Briggs & Stratton 500E 140cc engine.